We're showing off the very best games from the last year of PlayStation's dreams on PS4 and PS5. As always, our list is in no particular order, so make sure to watch until the end and let us know in the comments which stream was your favourite. We're kicking things off hot with Trips Voyage, a colourful platformer that began life as a Nintendo Mario clone, but has become so much more than that over the last year with two huge updates from the creator. I could gush about Trip all day long. Between the animations, the music, the boss fights, and the impressive four hours of content on offer, Trip is a game that could easily stand on its own two feet outside of dreams, and it's no surprise its creator has been snapped up by Blue Moon Studio to start their professional game dev career. World on Fire 2 is the epic sequel to Dream's PS4 standout Call of Duty Zombies inspired first person shooter. World on Fire 2 sets itself apart from its contemporaries with an extra level of polish and great map design in the dozen or so locations on offer. We're talking about a fully featured Call of Duty Zombies game with different game modes to keep things fresh and tight gunplay being one of the best FPS games in Dreams. Liminal styles itself as a psychological survival horror game, and as creepy games go, it's one of the best Dreams has to offer. So intense that apparently Sony PlayStation's legal team had a few things to say about it. Featuring FPS combat, resource management, and inspired by PlayStation classics Silent Hill, are you brave enough to delve into the smartly crafted and often terrifying world of Liminal? Sword of Akana is a massive open-world RPG somehow squeezed into dreams. A razor-sharp UI and a full day and night cycle are just two examples of the level of detail this game has. Explore the town of Alfria, collecting quests, crafting and shopping, then head out into the dangerous wilderness with your party to fight and level up with a modern Final Fantasy-like combat system you'll need to master in order to take down the boss monster. Gaia Hawk is a sci-fi arcade shooter with hours of content. You'll need to switch between two different firing modes in order to master the five different stages and their bosses. This is a challenging bullet hell game, but the tight controls and polished presentation makes it an absolute joy to play. This is yet another game that could easily stand on its own two feet outside of dreams.
Epsilon is a sci-fi adventure, a first-person shooter that sees you embroiled in an elaborate conspiracy you'll need to unravel. To do so, you'll need to trek across the gorgeous different biomes of a recently discovered alien planet as you contend with its hostile wildlife, deadly cyborgs and corporate goons. This is a narrative focused game with one hell of an ending. Hopefully Susan is still there. Dave, please tread carefully. Red and the Phantom Castle remake simply oozes charm with every breath. Red is an animated, affable little bugger whose wit and comedy really is the star of the show, of this lengthy action adventure that sees you trying to bring back colour to a world gone dark. Did I take a wrong turn? Somebody help, please! Anyone! Whoa! Whoa! The Backrooms is an episodic horror game based on the infamous internet creepypasta. This game reimagines the empty office building as a spatial phenomenon, an endless maze seemingly leading to another dimension, full of reality bending quirks and unknown horrors. Best of all, the backrooms crafts a tense atmosphere, you never know what's around the next corner, and you can't prepare for what comes next. Bose Island is a colourful platforming playground. Bose Island features some of the best game animations in all of Dreams, which you'll enjoy as you put Bo through the paces running, swimming, jumping and kazooing your way to the game's musical ending. Disdain, Depravity of the Night is a hack and slash side scroller best described as the beautiful love child of an old school Castlevania game and from software's Bloodborne. You'll use the power of heaven and hell to fight your way for an army of demented demons as you search for your missing family in a game that took a whopping two years to make. Dreamscape Revelations is another amazing sequel to a Dreams classic. While the first game focused on shifting between dimensions to solve puzzles and platforming challenges, 
this new iteration adds combat, set pieces and a skill tree to its epic fantasy narrative. I told you, he took Rygan and flew into the void. That was the last time I saw them. I don't know where he's at. Okay, so the next gen is somewhere in the swamp. Redline Turbo is an open world racing game with a wicked sense of speed. Drive through the map exploring and collecting cars, then take to the more structured time trial courses and burn up rubber trying to get to the top of the online scoreboards. Happy Jack Enter the Abyss is the Dark Souls of Dreams. Don't let the cutesy PS1 era mascot design fool you, Happy Jack has a combat system that, while satisfying, is hard as nails. This action adventure game had a huge update in 2022, adding an epic final boss fight to one of Dreams best games. Z Exodus 2 is a motorbike stunt platformer that truly shines in the presentation department. Playing similar to Joe Danger, you'll flip and trick your way through multiple stages and hang out in the overworld hub with plenty of flourishes to enjoy, like this awesome pinball game. What a big score! Feeding ducks is not what it first appears. Beneath the surface of this retro 2D Minecraft is something much more sinister. You'll start off collecting crystals and feeding your pet duck, but things aren't quite what they seem, and trust me when I say there's plenty to discover in the game's multiple endings. We're only halfway through our list, but we're giving you a little breather with some super special quickfire bonus dreams, which, while amazing, weren't quite long enough to make the main list. <gasps> the Flipside, an 8-bit retro style game where you're in an upside down like Nightmare World. Motorstorm Stranded, a shockingly on-point recreation of the PS3 classic racing game, Grip Gold, a puzzle game that uses the DualShock's motion controls, Protoland, a first-person shooter with a retro design, Scrollabidophobia, a horror text adventure that takes place in a 3D space, somewhere between a stunning graphical walk through a mysterious park, the appearance of evil, a gory rail shooter with a truly unique art style, Alaska, a cinematic man versus the element survival adventure, Turbo Drift, a high speed racing game slash traffic dodging simulator, 
And wrapping up our quick fire dream is Paladine, a cell shaded mini Dark Souls. <gasps> Before we head into the second half of our best dreams of 2023 list, quick reminder Ugly Sofa Gaming is now on Patreon. When it comes to video content of Dreams PS4 and PS5, we kind of think we're the bee's knees. So if you'd like to support the channel, check out our Patreon to which you'll find a link in the video description or comments below. Tiny Medieval 907 is an old timey city sim full of peasants and grain and all that rustic jazz. With a fantastic UI and art style, sound mechanics and plenty of different challenges to try, this old timey game is surprisingly modern. Urbex Deadly Activity is a first person horror game based on the noble pursuit of urban exploration. Great atmosphere and a mechanic where front facing light keeps monsters at bay and makes running away with your back exposed terrifying. Angel of Death is a game anyone playing Call of Duty back in 2008 should be familiar with. Take control of a deadly AC-130 and rain down hellfire on enemy combatants. The professional voice acting and a structured campaign full of upgrades for your flying death machine help take this one to the next level. Dark Strain is a top-down survival horror game where the zombies are deaf and blind but extremely sensitive to light, meaning being able to see is a luxury you sometimes can't afford. Combat puts emphasis on resource management and strategy rather than twitchy aiming skills. Exploration is risk versus reward. You never know when you're going to bump into a large group of zombies stumbling around in the dark but you'll need to stick your head out at least a little to find the materials to upgrade your weapons on the Last of Us style workbenches. Isle of Eras is an eerie narrative adventure where you can switch between first and third person, exploring a huge open world town that feels like it's about three Twilight Zone episodes smushed together in the best way. The impressive scale of the world and the brave choice not to include any handholding or waypoints lets you really get lost in this five hour epic. Strain feels like the game Hideo Kojima of the Metal Gear Solid fame would have made if he'd been denied his bank loan after leaving Konami and had chosen to make his next masterpiece in Dreams PS4. Strain has a wonderful Death Stranding kind of vibe. You wake up on a beach next to a corpse you are inexplicably connected to 
and so you need to drag, carry and maneuver this ghoulish companion through puzzles and platforming challenges in an enigmatic setting. Hookshot is a portal inspired puzzle game that combines a clean aesthetic with tight platforming controls. You'll need to master the different functions of the grapple hook including swinging and summoning to solve a series of head scratches in this one hour game that is merely a demo of a much larger project. Hell's Dungeon is an isometric dungeon crawler with fast paced combat that sees you taking on dozens of demonic enemies all at once in procedurally generated dungeons full of loot and scraps as you battle your way to the boss. With plenty of weapons to choose from and a massive skill tree to flesh out, this one will keep you busy for quite some time. Gain blood shards by defeating the generals of Hell. Pressure Chapter 2 is the second instalment of one of Dream's finest horror games, reminiscent of Alien Isolation, Soma and Bioshock. You sneak around gloomy underwater hallways and walk the sea floor, scavenging junk, dodging horrific monsters, and link back up with your friends in this cinematic adventure. Rid Memories of the Elders is absolutely bonkers. Some way, somehow, somebody has squeezed a massive 20 hour open world game into Dreams PS4. The core gameplay is all about exploration with a climbing and stamina mechanic not dissimilar to Zelda Breath of the Wild but with some parkour moves thrown into boot. Cold Conundrum 3 is the latest instalment of Dream's festive first person shooter franchise. The creator is one of Dream's premier FPS game designers and they've delivered yet again, mixing up the mechanics with a health regen feature where you need to slam and then snipe enemies midair, this game trains you to be a holly jolly snowman slaying machine. Gladiator 3022 is a Ratchet and Clank inspired combat shooter with hours of content and a narrative garnished with cool cutscenes that transforms this from being a simple wave survival game. The third person combat takes its cues from the greatest of all time Insomniac games with a huge variety of wacky weapons to unlock and upgrades as you fight to be called Champion. Mark on my armor. 
The Little Ninja 2 is a sequel to a game that was actually nominated for a Young Developer BAFTA award. This hectic action game features achievements, customization, secrets to find and 16 different stages to bamboo stick smash your way through. Ronin's Path is just a little epic. Take a fantastically told story, amazing animations, cutscenes, beautiful music, a gorgeous art style, and wrap it all up in a simple but enjoyable isometric game world that takes advantage of Dream's strengths in a hauntingly awesome experience. Those Childhood Summers is a slice of life game, a nostalgic romp through a 90s themed slightly fantastical summer where the biggest things we had to worry about were hanging out, cracking wise and uncovering a mad scientist's evil plan. If you've made it all the way to the end of the video and still want more, more, MORE of the very best games Dreams has to offer, go check out our Best Dreams of 2021 video on screen now.